girlfriend what's up and welcome to nicole does what come on in you asked for a house tour So we start here at the door with my wreath that I have made. I hope y'all I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Okay, you guys, here is my living room and all its glory. And you know this thing that I made. And I told you that I was just so in love with it that I didn't want to part with it. Here's my two chairs. And as you notice, I don't have light in this room, but hopefully in 2018, we'll begin light in this room. So here's the Christmas tree in all its glory. So, so in love with that. And my curtains that I got from TJ Maxx. And... This is the little bar card on 10. So this is, we doing Christmas here. So you get to see the tree, okay? Come on from the uh, living room to the dining room. Here's my dining room. And you guys have got to see this in its entirety because I did a, a, a blog on it. So, yeah, coasters I'm in love with, deers I'm in love with, Christmas tree on the table I'm in love with that, the pots I'm in love with that. Okay, here's my kitchen, and my kitchen is not finished. If you were a long, side, long time subscriber of mine, you would know I had wallpaper on this wall, and I just got tired of it one day, and I took it down. <laughs> so, yes, these everything in this house i did me and my husband did ourselves so this the kitchen and currently we are cooking christmas dinner so this is how the kitchen is looking my carrot my husband bought me that so proud of that man this is my favorite winter fruit right here, a pomegranate. You can eat it. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I ain't going to tell you how. I like it because I like it drenched in that Ciroc vodka because I am a Scorpio. So I have to support my Scorpio, my fellow Scorpio, Diddy. So, yeah. But I'm, you heard my mouth watering because I'm just thinking about this pomegranate and it. So rock apple vodka. Oh my God. This is the best. So everything is everything when you go into my kitchen. Now you are in my den. And this den is where everything goes down for its family. I don't know why I can't cut on that light, but I showed you this then before. I showed you it all cleaned up and made up. And I told you guys that I didn't pay too much for nothing in here because it's a den and children gonna be children and everything's gonna be everything. Okay, so next to next to this hold on somebody's calling okay back to the regular schedule program this is my door to my basement and i ain't nothing been done to this door i want to change the door and i want to do some 
fancy smancy things to this particular to this style of my basement and put a light there okay that's a project that i'm doing so we're going we're heading down the steps and these are the floors that i ran in my basement me and my husband because he had to help me okay those are the floors that he ran into my laundry room that he made and if you want to see that you just have to go back and see it i think or either it's in on my facebook wherever but this is my laundry room i'm done but bam with old washer and dryer but that's my laundry room and that's my freezer over there okay this is what i am most proud of because we brought this from nothing to something when we first got this house this was a full wall you can even get in here like that so one day Ishmael was at work and I just took a razor blade went like this all the way down and made me an opening and then you seen me lay the floors, you seen Ishmael buy these couches, you seen us put on the, up the drywall here and here, and then we finna put insulation here, put drywall here, finish this out for us 2008, put the bar stools there. If you're wondering what these brown boxes is, they are actually three bar stools that I bought when Target had them on sale for like a little bit of nothing. So about three bar stools okay and then that's my light that is my bottom for mother's day that's gonna go up in my living room okay so we done with down here and this is my entryway to my backyard which all these lights i ran when we first got this house there was no lights down here so i had to run wire and make lights so this is my junk in its entirety i mean this that's just the truth of it okay so you know ishmael got his man cave and i'm gonna have my woman cave and somewhere for my cousin to sleep when they come from alabama so at the end of the day this will be my woman cave here and it's just junky and this will be another bedroom when i get to it so i can't promise you when i'm gonna get to that okay we finished with downstairs that's my vision board these are my vision boards of things that i want to happen so that is that i'm just showing you the raw uncut stuff Okay, let's cut off all these lights because ain't nobody down here. <sighs> I'm gonna go back up. And you turn and you come up my hallway. We painted this hallway. This was my vision for a long time. I seen this in my dreams. I was like dreaming of things that I want to happen. And this is what happened. And I, I was in love with it for the moment, but now I'm over it. <laughs> the stripes, you know, I guess it was a vision for the moment. Okay, when you come up the stairs, you hit my bathroom. Nothing special. You have seen that. Linen closet. Fold up to the best of my ability. Coat closet. Dark in there, but bam. Okay, linen closet. This closet where I keep soap, washing pots, tissue, stuff, overflow, whatever we have in the house. Baby's room. You'll get to see that. My room. And like I told you, I'm cooking, so this is what it is. This is my bed. So gorgeous and y'all don't see in this room 
I think the only room that y'all really haven't seen was Carlos' room. And let me show you this one. So this is Mr. Carlos' room. Just so gorgeous. All the paint jobs in here, I did them. Bye, girlfriend. I hope you enjoyed this house tour. I'll see you on the next one. Be blessed. Have a great trip home, huh?